I'm sponsored. I got sponsored. I got sponsored. Once again by the sponsor gods. Guys, I've been sponsored by the coldest water. They reached out to me. I've just been using it all week, all right? Every time I go to dance rehearsals, everywhere I go, I bring it around the house. I normally have like this like cheap old like Amazon one and you know, it does not hold its temperature. This right here, no smoke. I don't even know why you guys chose me. I don't even have 100,000 subscribers. But yet you guys chose me, the coldest water. If you guys are interested, link in the description below. You could use code ENV to get 10% off your total purchase. The coldest water, try it, okay? Especially if you guys are dancing, really appreciate it. How's it going, you guys? Elliot here, hope you guys are doing okay. We are back with more 17 content. Well, actually, we're back with more Ming Hao content. V8, my man, came out with another contemporary art video. I did more research and I was figuring out what does this mean? This means... Ben, but apparently there's more than one definition. It can mean this, origin, roots of plant, basis, undergraduate, source, root, foundation. I'm getting a lot of like foundation, origin. What does this all mean? Let's figure this out together, okay? Let's just get right into it. Here we go, all right? Ooh. I like how it's shot in this like anamorphic format, this nice like cinematography, cinema-like format. I'm gonna say it again. I'm gonna do it. Again. I'm gonna do it again because I stand fucking dumb as fuck. Okay, here we go. I really like how it's like shot in this like anamorphic format, and it's actually shot with an anamorphic lens. You could tell by the blur. Normally, with spherical lens, you get the spherical blur. So I could tell why they shot it in this lens because normally when filmmakers shoot with this lens, they want to create this like dreamlike sequence because of that blur. So really cool, nice introduction. Let's go Ming Hao. Oh, and now it's just shot in 16 by 9. That's interesting. So I wonder if that sequence alone, the intro alone, was shot with a different lens. I swear, V8's like one of my most favorite dancers in the K-pop industry right now. Mm, I love how they use the this ancient Chinese instrument. The wardrobe goes really well. <gasps> Let's go. Hold on. Can we play this back? We're already two minutes in. Okay, I want to play this back. Don't worry, we'll run, we'll run it back again. I'm trying to enjoy it from a dancer's perspective, but also from like a photography perspective. It's shot really well. I love this fusion of b-boy and contemporary. And he sticks this, oh my God. 
That is what I saw on Twitter. That's what you guys have been sending to me on Twitter. And he kills it. It looks so good, too. Oh, is this, this is shot in reverse. What? I'm like speechless right now. Oh my. Okay, 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 okay. There's a lot of dissecting needed for this video, a ton. Um, it's awesome that he's in nature. And I really like the use of ancient Chinese instrument. I also had to do more research on this, okay? Apparently it's called the Gu Jin. Kill me if I did the translation wrong, Gu Jin. So, really interesting. And it's funny though, because the title of this video has a lot to do with like origin foundation, yet he's in the forest, which is like the epitome of nature. So I'm understanding. Okay. Hey guys, comment down below. Uh, I would love to know more context. I know for sure you carrots know a ton. As far as dancing goes, the eight. One of the most versatile dancers that I've seen in the K-pop industry. Uh, I, I love his fusion of b-boy and the fact that you know b-boy, it molds so well with contemporary, modern, all these technical styles. Let's run it back. So I'm just trying to digest, excuse all the silence. But, it's great how they use the Gu Jin, right? Which is a Chinese, um, it's a very traditional ancient Chinese instrument. If you guys don't know by now, the Yi Ming Hao is also Chinese as well. So definitely is a tribute to his ethnicity. So really cool. So from a dancer's perspective, what I really like to look at is the choreography diction. Like are his movements internalized? Are they isolated? How are the textures? And most of the time it's very symbolic of the intention with the narration of what they're trying to portray. The message behind everything. So it's funny that they his hands are coming out from dirt, which is like the root and the title. The titles one of the titles definitions was root origin. And it's also cool how some of his movements seemed inspired by nature. <laughs> this part trips me out so much. The eight, he fuses b-boy with contemporary so organically. It just looks very natural. And I love when dancers fuse those two styles together. This part trips me out the most. It's in reverse. It's in reverse, but the movement diction that he chose makes it look like he was fast forward. So watch this section right here.
Really cool. And then back in forward motion. I gotta say, shout out to the costume designer. Okay. So from what I'm getting is that nature, the origin of the age. And it's funny that he's in the forest too, because forest symbolizes like nature, the beginning of time. So from my translation of this video it seemed that the way the ape chose his movements and just the way the video was shot and the wardrobe it almost seemed like the ape was like a forest spirit like a nature spirit um judging by his movement diction everything seemed internalized it seems that all of his moves were influenced by nature elements of nature the animals of nature and just overall in general just the textures seemed influenced by nature so this video the eight felt like a tribute to his roots to his culture his roots to his dance experiences his, his roots to his artistic experience his roots to nature the earth with the Gujian, I feel like all those things came together to form his origin. Comment down below your translation. What did you guys get out of this? I really enjoy getting your guys' point of view, so please comment down below. And yeah, like this video if you liked it, dislike it if you dislike it. This was just super cool in general. I love watching the A. He's definitely one of my more favorite dancers for sure in the K-pop industry. So it's like the things he does, man, and he could sing like it's just it blows my mind like this video if you liked it dislike it if you dislike it thank you to all my current active patreon subscribers if you'd like to support this channel please support this channel on patreon patreon.com slash elliot new village helps keep this channel rowing and going and thank you to the coldest water for sponsoring this video if you guys would like to get 10 percent off your total order use the code env for checkout referral link in the description below i'll see you guys in the next one